Uh, welcome to the next session. Uh, in this particular session, uh, we will be knowing what are the different equipments uh, we have uh, to be, we will be using in this particular engineering drawing class. Uh, of course, like you will be knowing like uh, what is mini drafter is and I was saying something like uh, we will be having set square and protractor like that will be completely replaced with your uh, mini drafter. So, what these set square can do is like it can make different angles like this is with 30 degree, this is 60 degree and this is 45 and this set square is 45 and on this combination we can make different angles like uh, 15, 30 degree, 45 degree, 60 degree, 90 degree all those degrees can be made without this particular protector uh, where here you can always go for 10, 20, 30, 40 and all the uh, angles can be made with this and these two combinations are replaced by your mini drafter. I will have I will make a, a special video like uh, to explain completely like how this uh, set square can be used and these two are now replaced with your mini drafter fine. So, you may not even need a ruler because like you have a vertical and horizontal scale. So, all these four equipments what we have what we use till now are completely replaced by your mini drafter. So, this is the final equipment what we are going to use completely and uh, this is uh, three pencils. It may look same, but uh, these are different shades of pencils. Again, uh, to explain the different shades, I will make a particular video and this one is like uh, we have H, 2H, 3H and HP pencil. So, all these will be having different different thing where HB will be using for uh, borders, uh, title block, lettering, then arrowheads, then we will be using H pencil for drawing finishing line, visible line and hidden line. Then your 2H pencil will be used for drawing construction lines, dimension line, center line and section line. And apart from that like we have too many things that will be discussed in detail in uh, your lectures and these are about uh, different pencils what we have. Then obviously, you will be using uh, sharpness and cello tapes is required and this clips already we have fixed there. So, that clip is required about eraser and of course, like uh, you may need some uh, knife for cutting your uh, uh, edges or sometime your cello tape. Then comes your engineering drawing box. This engineering drawing instruments will be having different equipments where only these type of compass should be used. You cannot go for your normal geometry box compass. Like this complete thing should be used. So, and for those who are using it for the first time like uh, you will have a compass like this the bigger one. If you are going for the smaller one it is completely fine. Uh, you have to again purchase needle like this and even these needles you can get like uh, HP, H and 2H those type of needles can be directly brought from the shop. If you are using this and that type of thing will be fixed to this like this where that needle will be fitted to this and this particular thing is for uh, smaller division where you can maximum go for uh, 40 mm. And this is the longer length compass what you have and that like first you will be having something like this. This needle what is being attached that should be removed out and if you are going to use the normal pencil what you have, you have to attach this particular attachment uh, in your uh, from your geometry box, uh, instrument box what you have. Then that should be fixed like this here you have a edge over here that should be fixed to this and you can lock it. And mostly compass is used for drawing construction line. As I told earlier, what is being used for construction line? Hey, 2H right. So, 2H pencil will be always fit to this.
so only for construction line we are going to have compass so construction line mostly your 2 h pencil will be useful so 2 h will be fixed to this now apart from that we have different needles like this particular thing where again you can replace this and insert this again if you are going to insert this you will be going with this needle whatever you have so this needle can be fixed to the holder over here it can be broken into small piece and that can be fixed over here so that can be slided inside and you can fix this particular needle like if you are using going to use this particular needle if not this is more than enough like this type of attachment is also available in your uh, engineering compass like that can be directly fixed and and this can be used and while purchasing your pencil one thing i forgot to say like don't purchase pencils from different company of different grade if you are going to purchase all three like mostly it should be of same company so that like you will have the proper shading because if you are going for different different company the shading may differ so always like whatever the pencil you are going to buy either it is hp or h or 2h you go for the same company what you are going to purchase then you have something called divider like uh, this is actually used to mark the different points like uh, if you could see here like uh, suppose we have a line of around 10 centimeter what will happen here is uh, suppose consider like uh, you have a small line maybe like a small line of around uh, this is h so i'll go with hp for better visibility right so this if you are going to use your divider what you'll do is if you want to get some equal sections like maybe of around uh, something two centimeter so what you can do is fix here then make a dot here then roll it make a dot here then roll it make a dot here then roll it make a dot here by this like your bisection will be very easy if you are going to use your divider so this is how your divider can also be used so these are the basic things how you can use your uh, instruments for drawing uh, for using your drawing sheet for to be used in your drawing sheet